dragon newt? Is it dangerous? It's a young type of dragon. So dangerous is what you mean. Stop it! Stop it! Look who's gonna crack. Let's do this! Hey! Hellion! I'm over here! Saray? Shepard. If it's too much to handle, run! Right. We just need to buy enough time for those two to escape. Run back! the proper elements to face this one. Do we die here? Let's not die here. I know, but... <sighs> Rose, what are you doing? I told you to get out of here! I know, I know! But it's all my fault that things ended up like this! I told you to forget about it! See if you can manage without me for a little bit. Huh? Rose. Huh? So you can hear me now. I'm impressed. <laughs> Rose, it's okay to be scared. Just hang in there and listen to me. <sighs> so Ray's like that too. We grew up together, but he still tenses up a little when he sees me. We Seraphim are indeed Saray's friends. And yet, we cannot say for sure if Saray sees and hears the same things we do. Because he's the only human out of all of you? Yes. Saray has no human compatriots who can truly understand the burden he bears as the Shepherd. You want... me... to join him? It's ultimately your call. What's your name? Nicleo! Come here! Coming. Nicleo! Fine, how do you do if there ever was one? All right, damn it! I'll prove to you I can do this! Saray, Nicleo, and... Uh... <sighs> what? What's wrong with you? I... I... I'm joining the fight! It looks like she's made up her mind. And she did it all herself, too. Lila, I'll buy us some time. You get the Squire's pack going. But Saray, you have to give her a true name first. Wilkis Wilk! Huh? That's the true name I'm giving to Rose. Uh, all right. Offer your protection. Don't you charge in like that. Hold out just a bit longer. I know. I'm just buying time. Let's keep it up. How's this? Howling Taylor.
Ocean Blitz! Astronauts? What's wrong? Dazzle is becoming Lila's sublord? What? We're here! You made it! Right, then let's show this dragon out. I've had enough of this, Shepard. I'm done playing around. Now you're going to bring my armadas to life. Dazzle, why are you... When this is all over, we're gonna have a talk. This is the Armadus. Bro, so the Hellion has scales. Does that make it a Scalian? Wait, what? Final protection, here goes! Final protection, join the blitz! Blow him down! Watch your help! Dog Seraph? Good work out there. Uh, uh. Rose? Uh, uh. Ro hey, pull yourself together. Did you think it was Rose? It's me. What? Leave her alone, you maniac. You're quite attached to her, I see. What are you after? Oh, nothing really. Just making sure it was clear to everyone why you wanted to become a sublord. Shepard, allow me to explain. I understand, Dezel. Listen! It seems there's some sort of agenda you want to accomplish with the Armatus, Dezel. That's right.
and I'm using you to that end. Deal with it. What is it you want, then? Revenge. Against the Hellion who killed my friend. Tarnished the name of the Windriders. Branded them as criminals. And forced them to live out the rest of their lives in secrecy as an Assassin's Guild. Oh yeah? Well, in that case, you're more than welcome. We love quelling Hellions. Hmm. <laughs> you mean saving them, in other words. Does that sound like revenge to you? You're out to kill them? <laughs> Lila, how could you invite someone like him to be your sublord? Because of how he is. Dezel is consumed with vengeance, and yet he has not become a Hellion. Because he has a vessel that cannot be corrupted. Rose. I get it. So if Rose were to accompany us by herself, then Dezel would lose his pure vessel, and before long, his lust for revenge would turn him into a Hellion. Don't make me laugh. I'd sooner die than become the same corrupted being as the one who wronged me. You folks forced my hand. But something tells me that you're not too bent out of shape over it. <laughs> I won't deny it. It did give me a sense of the true power of the Armatus, after all. I understand your reasons now. But if you're going with us, you can't be acting like a lone wolf. <laughs> Don't worry. I'll work with you. I'm a crummy Seraph, but I'm still a Seraph. I've got no reason to oppose what the Shepherd does. True. Well, I guess that's true. But nevertheless, keep what I told you a secret from Rose. She believes that she's come as far as she has with her own ability, without anyone's help. I don't want her to be troubled by the knowledge of what I've been doing behind her back, or the reasons why I did it. Dezel. Well, that's that. Now we're all best buds, right? Don't toy with her. Make sure she's all right. She's fine. She just passed out from shock. I think you tossing her on the floor like that is what did it. <sighs> Why don't we plan on resting here for a while until Rose wakes up? It looks like the other Seraph still hasn't regained consciousness. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs>